Okay, my name is Ke Ching Zhang. I'm from University of Miami, a mechanical and aerospace engineering department. Uh, my next project is a silent and efficient bidirectional supersonic flying wing. This design uh, is a symmetric about two axes. Uh, it's symmetric about longitudinal axis and the span wise axis. So this is different from conventional airplane design. For this particular phase one project, we want to um, prove the concept that it can generate very high efficiency and the low sonic boom just from computer simulation. When you fly supersonic, um, the shockwave is generated by the blockage, by uh, volume. So we want to minimize the volume. Um, so in other words, when you fly supersonic, you like to uh, the fly the body with a slender body. But when it's too slender, it's difficult to take off. So this way we can take care of both. So we can easily take off this way and then uh, supersonic will fly this way. So we can take care of both. Um, this gives us a, a big advantage. Supersonic flight is forbidden to fly above land. And so if you cannot fly above land, it's not economically viable. We're re trying to remove the sonic boom. At the same time, it can achieve very high aerodynamic efficiency. Because as I said, when we fly supersonic at a high speed, we have very high sweep angle and so overall very slender the shape. So high aerodynamic efficiency gives us uh, less fuel burn and uh, less emission pollution. Well, basically it's much more convenient, right? Travel from uh, New York to Los Angeles now is about, uh, I think one direction is about five hours. The other, I think it's basically about five hours. We can reduce to about one hour or two hours. So, and then the other travel from uh, New York to Shanghai or Tokyo, for example, we're talking about 14, 15 hours. So we can reduce it to like, a, you know, four hours, five hours. So that's much shorter time. So what I really wish is that maybe down the road, like 10 years or 15 or 20 years, we can have a commercial flight using this concept for people. Be audacious, be um, imaginative and creative. And a lot of things are uh, reachable. For example, this idea, you know, when you at the beginning, when you just think is people think it's just science fiction. Nobody will give you money to study it. NAC is uh, extremely valuable because this kind of um, high-risk project, we are exploring some new ideas, you know, which may or may not work. So this is very difficult to get money from private uh, section. And government support this kind of exploration, I think is uh, very, very valuable.